What is your name and where do you live? My name is Nikolaus Pietrek. I live in Falkensee. It's a small town near Berlin in Germany. How long have you been working on the Jinka project? Quite a long while. Actually, I started, I decided to build a Jinka or to make the Jinka to realize the project in 2003. It took me quite a while to check out the patent situation. And since I was doing all in my spare time, it took quite a while uh, to finish it uh, after 13 years. Now, the first test uh, model is ready and we can start. How has nature inspired you to come up with a Jinka? Well, nature has inspired me in the sense that I observed the birds, how they fly, and found out a couple of very important aspects which I didn't find in literature, which is the ballistic moments of the heavy bird, uh, of the heavy bird's body flying through the air. You have to carry that. And um, I studied different ways of uh, flight, uh, among others the bolt flight, which is very important, which is also very much ballistics. And then I put, uh, put bits and pieces together and finally came up with the Jinka. Why do you think people will enjoy flying the Jinka as a sport? Well, actually any sports competition is fun. Uh, um, the, the group uh, you are with uh, mostly are your friends and you are at the fresh air. And of course you will only fly, fly with the sunny weather. And if parachute flying is, uh, or paragliding is fun, try to imagine uh, how, it will, how funny it will be to fly with a Jinka actively from one upwind to the next, trying to be the fastest and so forth. Why is taking the Kremer Prize sports important to you? The Kremer Prize is very important. Uh, first of all, it's a challenge to get the Kremer Prize. It's very hard. It's going to be very hard. Uh, secondly, the Kremer Prize has been uh, uh, donated in order to organize popular flying sport with human power. And uh, since it's quite dangerous and we, the safety aspects are very important, it's very important and uh, essential to get permission uh, to organize this sport. And by winning the Kremer Prize, automatically, I guess and I hope, that the Royal Aeronautic Society will open us the doors to formalize all these uh, different aspects that are needed for the organizations, uh, for the clubs um, and, and all these administrative uh, things, insurance for example. So I very much hope that by winning the Kramer Prize the Royal Aeronautic Society will support us in a way that we really can finally uh, offer good sports opportunities to the public. Thank you very much for the interview. I have to thank you. Welcome. Bye bye. See you next time. Sehr gut. So, jetzt.